All right, so there's been a few uh, fruitless days uh, here in Norway I'm on an island in the cabin. Uh, but I've done a pretty nice haul of fruit today, although nothing is ripe. But uh, I got a, lots of bananas, and can you believe it? I, you know, I ordered a box of bananas from the store. I came there today, and they told me that, oh, the bananas were overripe. They were spotty, so I threw them away, and they were thrown away, and I couldn't. They didn't allow me to go get it. So that's like what? I needed ripe bananas, and they had a box of ripe bananas. But instead of selling it, they said. No, it's gone bad. It needs to be thrown away. Pretty crazy. Anyway, so I got a bunch of bananas, different ripeness level, but none of them are really ripe. Although these ones are probably going to be ripe maybe in a couple of days. Uh, and also, there's uh, like a farmer's market today with uh, lots of fresh produce that's not sprayed. So um, I got apples. Uh, and I have my doubts with apples. They're always sour <laughs> it's very difficult to find apples that are not sour but i hope these are going to be okay spray free um got some more apples here as well as a few avocados as always i found the, the sweet potatoes i have enjoyed a lot lately the egyptian sweet potatoes they're going to get more later next week so i got what they had and i'm going to get more later little bag of cute little cherry tomato type things. There were some kids selling them, picked from the garden, so I had to buy that. Um, I got some pumpkins, a couple of those. I actually bought a cabbage. I'm gonna steam it up. I, I don't usually eat many greens, but I don't know. I wanted to try it. Some more uh, cherry tomatoes, look very nice. And then I got some potatoes, like regular potatoes, again, spray free and uh, probably delicious. And then a whole bunch of uh, Hokkaido pumpkins, which are so amazing. Again, spray free, local, fresh, super, super, super fresh, just cut. So um, that's going to be my diet for the next week. Uh, and uh, hopefully the bananas will ripen quickly. I'll do my best to ripen them faster. Uh, I'm gonna use some of the strategies that I talk about in my uh, in the little banana book that we sell on our website. Some of the strategies for ripening the fruit faster. Um, and until I can get that happening, I'm gonna have to eat uh, pumpkin for breakfast, rice porridge, that sort of thing. Um, it's been difficult actually eating no fruit. Yesterday I had a day with no fruit. All rice, rice, sweet potato. Very difficult. Hopefully this will ripen up quickly. But even if it doesn't, even until it does, eating uh, pumpkins and stuff is much easier to digest and more delicious than eating rice, really. So I think we're all right. This is uh, what I've got. And I'm here in uh, Norway. And it's really, it's been a beautiful day, even though now it's a bit overcast home in the boat. I also rented three movies from the library because I'm all alone and lonely in the evening and I'm also reading lots of books. So that's it for today. Hope to see you soon. If you haven't subscribed already do so and I will see you in the next video.